This kestrel is one of many birds of prey that end up at the Serrano Animal and Bird Hospital in Lake Forest every year. Red tails, screech owls, anywhere from 200 to 300 every uh, year that come through this hospital and this is where they're triaged and then from here they're made ready for release and then the ones that are releasable are put up in another location into flight cages. Dr. Scott Weldy is also with the Orange County Bird of Prey Center and wants to teach people to leave birds of prey alone. Because birds of prey nest everywhere. The big thing is people take them and keep them for a week or two and then the bird becomes socialized to people and then it's non-releasable. We either have to find a place that'll keep him or he gets euthanized. There are laws on the books about birds of prey. With birds of prey, it's a federal and a state violation to uh, disturb in any active nest in the state of California. These birds act just like this. See how docile he is? This is common for him to be this docile. And he's, if you look at his feathers, see he doesn't even have, he's not what they call hard pin. His feathers right here are all baby feathers. And these guys at this age and stage tend to want to pretend that they're invisible. They're learning to fly. The older, bigger one pushed him out of the nest or he's learning to fly and he jumped down. And so he's laying on the ground being invisible and then somebody walking by his nest finds him thinking that a human thinks that there's something wrong with him and there's really nothing wrong with him. He's just learning to fly and it may take him a week or two. The Orange County Bird of Prey Center works on donations. Anyone interested in helping out can call 949-837-0786. Owls are cool. They have all kinds of adaptations. I mean, they've got these, you know, the feather combing on the feather makes them silent flyers. Got huge eyes. Mark Eads reporting for OCregister.com.